guys, Marcus here and welcome to Chinese Entertainment Update January 22nd, 2020 edition. In this edition, The Pillow Book's official premiere announcement. And Leo Luo and Arthur Chen are immortals. But first, this is an aerial shot from the airplane as we prepare to land in Ho Chi Minh City in Vietnam. It's one day here where I'll get some much needed sleep and then it's off to Malaysia promptly for a big family reunion. Anyway, on of the show. So I spoke about it in my last video and now they have confirmed it. Three Lives, Three Worlds, The Pillow Book officially announced their January 22nd premiere date. The 58 episode series focuses on the 2000 year romance between Bai Feng Jiu, played by Del Raba, and Dong Hua Di Jun, played by Feng Go Gao. It showcases the strength of their love that, despite many trials and tribulations, lasts three lifetimes. They released three posters to represent the three lifetimes. This one featuring the two stars as Bai Feng Jiu and Dong Hua Di Jun. This one featuring them as Concubine Chen and Emperor Song and this one featuring them as Aranya and Chen Ye. The supporting cast includes Baron Chen, Dylan Kuo and Wayne Liu, and Yang Mi supposedly makes a guest appearance. VIP members get 6 episodes in advance and starting February 20th can pay for additional episodes and can view the finale as early as March 5th. As far as English subs go, they will be available on Viki, WeTV and I'm guessing eventually on YouTube as well. So enjoy guys, I know many of you have been waiting for this for a long time. And staying on the topic of confirmed rumors, I recently spoke about Leo Luo and Arthur Chen being rumored to star in the costume drama Hao Yi Sing. They have now confirmed that as well, tagging the two actors on their Weibo page. The message says, New Year's Eve is approaching. Master Chu at Leo Luo, Mo Weiyu at Arthur Chen have letters. They also added in the message, name billing in no particular order, meaning there's no official first or second lead, at least not for the moment. I guess after the whole fiasco between Yang Zi and Chris Wu's fans about who should be the first lead in the golden hairpin, production decided to nip it in the bud. Do you guys think it's a good move by production? Like I said in previous videos, they will very likely have to assign a first lead internally. On the screen, however, they can have both stars' names appear together side by side. Anyway, the drama, which is based on the novel The Husky and His White Cat, Si Zun, has been given the running English title of Immortality. In the drama, Leo Luo plays the Grand Master of the Cultivation World, whereas Arthur Chen plays his rebellious disciple, who eventually turns over a new leaf. Sabrina Chen co-stars as another one of the disciples. The drama is slated for 50 episodes and is reported to become the most expensive boys love drama adaptation ever made. And that's another thing too, the fact that it's based on a BL novel raises questions. We all know about the censorship issues, so production is going to have to make some adjustments, whether major or minor. Will they remove the BL element completely? Will they change the gender of certain characters? Will they stay as true as possible to the novel? I guess we'll all find out in time. In any case, the drama will feature a CGI from the team who brought you Ashes of Love, and also costume design from the team who brought you Evernight. It will also reportedly start shooting in two months' time. And speaking of BL adaptations, Ford Forever, the Republican era drama starring Huang Zitao and Jackson Yi, started streaming on January 20th. Set during a period of great unrest towards the end of the Qing Dynasty, the drama tells the story of a forward-thinking noble played by Huang Zitao. His character is also the leader of an assassin's group called Yan Shi Fan. He meets Jackson Yi's character, a commoner with the skills of an assassin, and they band together to save their country. The drama also stars Hu Bingqing as a princess of the declining Qing Dynasty. Huang Zitao had a similar type drama play recently in which he starred with Sophie Zhang. It was also a Republican era drama about a group of hot blooded youths, and it was entitled Hot Blooded Youths. Reportedly, Ford Forever removed the BL element completely and changed it into a bromance. I guess we'll see how that turns out. The drama is slated for 58 episodes and releases 2 episodes every Monday to Wednesday on Youku. It is also available on YouTube, no English subs at the moment. If you recently became a fan of Zhang Ruoyun after watching Joy of Life, well there's more of him to come. He stars in an upcoming modern drama entitled Perfect Evidence. In the drama, he plays a prosecutor with high IQ but low EQ and only believes in evidence. His co-star, Jun Yen, plays a detective who prioritizes efficiency and fast results. 
This is actually a reunion for the two stars. They were the leads in medical examiner Dr. Chin, which came out in 2016. Perfect Evidence started filming towards the end of last year. I'll keep you guys updated on it. And I also have a couple of movie updates for you guys. The 1987 Hong Kong movie, A Chinese Ghost Story, starring Leslie Cheung and Joey Wong, is getting another remake. This latest one is a web movie entitled The Enchanting Phantom, starring Chen Xingxu and Eleanor Lee. The movie tells the story of a timid debt collector who meets and falls in love with a young maiden after he takes shelter at a deserted temple one night. He finds out the next morning that she is a ghost, but despite that, helps free her from her servitude to a sinister demoness. The 1987 version is one of those classics that spawned sequels and numerous remakes. Cheng Xingxu was terrific in Goodbye My Princess, and Eleanor Lee is a young up-and-coming star, so fans will be excited to see what they can bring to this remake. For me though, Leslie Cheung is a Hong Kong legend, and Joey Wong is a classic 80s beauty, so if I do catch The Enchanting Phantom, I will watch it as its own movie, and try not to do too many comparisons. I will let you guys know when and where to watch it when it premieres. Oversized Love is an upcoming movie starring Johnny Huang and Guan Xiaotong, and it is slated to hit theaters on March 6th. It is a romantic comedy which follows a girl who's conscious about her weight and who gets into a love triangle with a musician and an actor. Darren Chen of Meteor Garden 2018 fame co-stars. So just a quick recap before I let you guys go. Forward Forever premiered on January 20th. The Pillow Book will premiere on January 22nd. And Oversized Love will hit theaters on March 6th. And that's it for this edition, guys. This show would not be possible without your support, whether it's through Patreon or simply by watching, liking, and subscribing. So thank you all for watching, and I wish you clear blue skies, good health, and happiness. Until next time, cheers.